Hey, I'm Alan Brito from Blender 3D Architect and welcome to this tutorial about a hidden option in Blender that gives us a way to use or pick a shadeless material. And by shadeless material, I mean a surface that will not interact, react or do anything uh, regarding lights on your scene. It will keep the same color all the time. Uh, you can apply a texture or you can use a solid color. Let me show you how it works. When you are crafting a material from scratch, uh, what we usually do is to open uh, the shader editor, press shift A and choose here under shader among several different options. But there is nothing here that points to a shadeless material. However, uh, there is uh, one tool in Blender, one resource that will create this shadeless material for you. And that's, uh, that's exactly why I'm always saying that this option is hidden in Blender. Because if you press Shift A here on the preview viewport and choose Image Mesh Plane, which is the old add-on, the import images as planes, uh, you will see a shadeless option. And here I have the menu with the options to import an image as a plane. You can choose any image. Uh, this is the workflow that you have to uh, perform or to follow if you want to use this shadeless option on any project. You can even save it as an asset. I will choose any image and here under shader, I will choose the shadeless option. This is the material that I want. This is not actually a material. It's a collection of nodes. It's uh, already uh, with a setup that will not react to light in any way. One important thing, you have to disable here the alpha if you want to use it with a solid color. So I will import this plane. It's here on my scene. And as you can see, we have a material. If you want, you can open the material editor. I will rename this to shadeless. Create a fake user. So Blender will not remove it in any way. And here, if you don't want to use this shadeless material with a texture, you can easily remove this node and if you select this node group here and press tab you will see the setup required to create the shadeless option if you want of course you can create this from scratch but it's already here and uh, you might think well why would i need a shadeless material in blender uh, for design and architecture one of the cases where i uh, use a, sh a shadeless material uh, the most is with text and annotation in case you want to use something here that you want to uh, point or add details uh, explain something about your design and put it on the scene you will most likely want that to highlight or do not interact uh, with uh, your lights uh, on a scene so how can i use it on um, for instance this plane here let me show you you can select the object and from here you can choose your shadeless option for something that uh, like a black color, it will not highlight. They will look the same even on uh, under render uh, render uh, a rendered uh, viewport. But uh, if you ch change the color, for instance, let's say I want to use something like a red color, you will see that it will not look red because it's interacting with light. This is just a regular material. But if I choose here the shadeless option and go with red you can see the difference this one is shadeless regardless of the lightning the setup that i will be using here on my project it will always be red uh, unlike this one that will interact depending on the lights if i set this with a less power it will get closer to uh, red but on the other hand uh, I will need more light for my scene. If I get it really strong, a strong light, it will start to uh, shift into a more lighter color. So this is it. This is how you can use a shadeless material in Blender. And of course, you can select this material, right click and set that as an asset, mark that as an asset 
to reuse on future projects. And this is it. I hope you like this. I hope you liked this tutorial and if you find it useful, it might help someone else, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any of the future tutorials. See you next time. Bye.